Hi everybody, so today I'm going to be doing a video on past horses. I've been receiving a lot of um, mail regarding past horses. Um, you know, what are they? How do I get them? Um, just general questions like that. So, a past horse isn't anything special. It's not like a special or divine or anything like that. It's just your normal, everyday horse. Um, basically, when your horse reaches the age of 30, if it doesn't have a philosopher's stone, then, and it dies over the age of 30, and you send it to heaven once it's dead, don't put it in the safe haven, you ha it has to actually die, and then you click send to heaven, you will then get a pass. Um, now this horse is in my past horse tab because it's over 25. You have to be careful when they get to 25 because they start to lose health every single day. They lose about when they've not got water of you because I think you lose one health every day. Well, every time you age them when they've got water of use. But when they've not got water of use, every time you age them they lose two health. Um, so you need to be careful like with what you do. Basically all I do is lesson, stroke, drink, carrot, spoon, and then feed about 17, 18 pounds, something like that. Put bed in the middle and then eat. I don't use my pass horses for passes. I use my pass horses for money. When they get to about 27 I sell them because in the sales then you click more than 27 equal to zero passes less than let's say let's say less than 60k let's see if there are any okay so all of these are immortal oh that one's not oh I'm on the um, auction so that's one of the direct sales Okay, so all of these horses are immortal, so they're not past horses. So I've, when I get that hot opal to 27, I've definitely got more than 60k in cash. So let's say 70. Okay, let's see if there's any immortal horses. 70k. Mm, nope. Okay. There. Okay, so that horse is 29 years and 8 months, so it's only got to age a little bit and then it can just die. An easy way to kill it is just don't feed it at all. And, um, you know, basically don't feed it. Um, maybe do some competitions with it because I think that helps it to lose health. Um, and then it will die pretty soon. So there's one. And that's it. So that's the cheapest one. 80k. So since my horse would be about two years, you know, two years younger, I'd probably put it in for around 70 to 75k. So a few aging points, and I've got plenty. I'll show you in a minute. Plenty of aging points, 383. So, as soon as I get that horse to 27, put it in the sales. Someone will probably buy it overnight because they sell pretty quickly when you do it as the cheapest pass horse in the sales. Um, and then when I wake up in the morning, I'll, I'll be 70k richer, maybe 75. We'll see what happens. Um, so, I hope this video was useful to you. Um, I hope it's you know cleared things up a little bit. Um, remember, when it's thirty, do not put it in the safe haven. Wait for it to die naturally. 
and then when it's dead click send to heaven and just remember that when it's 25 it will start losing health so don't start doing you know rides and competitions with it just and you need to be careful with what you feed it make sure you feed it just right so it doesn't get too skinny or too fat um, but yeah it gets a pass just for aging a horse so easy way to get a pass or easy way to make money now what I tend to do is I'll go into sales and buy you know like horses from about 19 plus keep them for a while sometimes I'll age them a little bit and just you know look after them every day so that they age every day you don't even have to use aging points then and you can save them up and you know they then become a pass horse when they're 27 I just chuck them in the sales for a bit low a bit lower than whatever the cheapest one already is at and it'll most likely be sold in the morning or even before then quite often it's before then you know if it's the cheapest and um, so yeah thanks for watching please comment rate and subscribe and remember my videos are not about hacking costs they're just to help you out thank you bye